Welcome to Reef Diary, day 83. So yesterday I said I would give you a bunch of macro shots, so that's what you're about to get. So here are some of the SPS corals that I received from Duane recently, and there's some other ones mixed in as well. Uh, I wanted to kind of showcase these also so he could see how they're doing, and you know, as well as to give you kind of some eye candy, because usually you can't really see these from far away. These next few shots are a few of the frags I got from Seachem. And I don't even know their names. I'm going to have to figure them out one by one so I can actually identify these things, not only for you, but as well as for myself. But they sure are pretty. At least I know what this one's called. It's a Plasma Anacropora. And it sure is a different color than what you normally see. This should be the Sin City Acropora that I got from Ryan. And this is the Lost Soldier from Dwayne. And this is some type of Montipora. I really like the ridges in there. And the blue polyps are really bright. And this is another blue tort that I got from Dwayne. I believe Dwayne called this one Lost Soldier's Brother. Has some really pretty purple tips. And this is a yellow scroll coral with green polyps. There's the Walt Disney slightly off to the left. And this is the home wrecker, and it's looking really good, and I'm starting to see hints of yellow. This is the T-Rex frag I got from Frank's Tanks. And this is the ectoplasm, I believe. There's that Walt Disney a little bit more close up. This is some blue tort that survived the potassium disaster. About half the colony died, but the top is alive and pretty. Don't know what this guy is. Kind of hope it's an Eflo. This is more ectoplasm that I have in the back of the reef. This one may be called Frog Skin from ORA. And it came from Dwayne a couple of months ago. Here are some brand new tips coming off the Shadowcaster. And this unknown coral is starting to get some interesting colors. So maybe Ryan will recognize it soon and tell me what it is. Here's the Forest Fire Digitata. And that super colorful chalice has now evened out, and there's a the little green brain that I got from Terra Reef. And look how this chalice is almost completely healed of all that bone white look that we saw a month ago. The maize coral and the branching cephastria look good. And then finally, my favorite chalice. So good, I took two pictures of it. Actually, that's a reflection in the glass. I hope you enjoyed today's macros. Please hit like, and I'll see you tomorrow.